The goal of this Revit Blender project was to create a complex building shape as easily as possible and make a basic render with some great Arcvit add-ons. Hi, here is Wonderfra. Thanks for all your subs and likes, and let's get started. I created a new Revit project with the metric architectural template, but the process is the same using the Imperial one. Using model lines, I created references in plan view to place the walls, some of which are rounded. The commands I used include arc line, mirror, trim, peak lines, dimension, circle line, move and copy. Next, I added levels to define the different floor plans and to help when placing the walls. I then added walls defining start and end levels. To make the columns, I use the in-place wall tool. As you can see, if you have reference lines, it's easier because you can use the pick lines tool rather than drawing everything from scratch. I added some basic ceilings with the sketch tool. For the windows, I used the curtain walls, placing them in the middle of the walls. At the entrance, I simulated glass doors with the same curtain wall, just adjusting the height. In the 3D view, I hit the model lines and exported the model in FBX to make the render in Blender. After importing the FBX into Blender, I joined all the objects by categories, such as glass, walls and so on. This made it easier to add the same material to all the objects of the same type in one click. Next, I added a camera, adjusted the view and enabled cycles. I added an HDRI using Gaffer, which is the add-on from Polyhaven. 
If you don't have it, you can download and add all the HDRI for free from their website. To add the materials, I used Materialik. An alternative could be Blender Kit, where you can find many free materials. Next, I created the base to add some vegetation using a plane dividing it into sections and separating the grass area. I then added the grass with botanic and an external floor material with material -ic. To improve the render, I added some contrast. Finally, I used the botanic again to add bushes and trees. What do you think about combining Revit and Blender to make architectural visualizations? Let me know in the comments and see you next time!